walk in the Arctic. It is one of the coldest places on Earth. Snow and ice are everywhere. Let's take a walk through the Arctic and see what wintry wonders we find. You'll need your snowshoes to explore the Arctic. Most of the land is snowy and freezing. Look around. Do you see any trees? This part of the Arctic is called the tundra. Here, it is too cold for trees to grow. Now we see the icy Arctic Ocean. Huge mountains of ice, called icebergs, float in the water. Believe it or not, some special animals live in this freezing place. And we can find them if we look closer. In chilly Arctic waters, we find a white whale. It's called a beluga whale, and it swims under the ice. When it needs to come up for air, it can break the ice with its head. Harp seals swim in cold Arctic waters too. Luckily, both seals and whales have a thick layer of fat called blubber that keeps them warm. This baby seal builds up its fat by drinking its mother's rich milk. Here come Arctic foxes. They don't seem to mind the cold. They have thick fur coats. They even have fur on the bottoms of their feet and in between their toes. Now we see a snowy owl. This graceful bird is a great hunter because of its amazing hearing. It can hear a little mouse moving under a pile of snow. You might not notice this Arctic hare at first. The hare's white fur is camouflage. Camouflage is a pattern or color that helps an animal blend in with its surroundings. And it's a good thing that the Arctic hare can hide. The clever Arctic wolf is trying to hunt it. However, the Arctic wolf's fur is camouflaged too. It can hide in the white snow and sneak up on the hare. But the ruler of the Arctic is this great white bear. Do you know its name? It's a polar bear, the largest kind of bear on Earth. And we better stay out of its way. Now our walk through the Arctic is ending. So take off your snowshoes and take one last look at this magical frozen land and the awesome animals that live here. What can you see in the Arctic? Talk about it. See you soon.